today's topic is the easiest way to create your first six-figure month or six-figure day. So I'm excited to talk about this. Um, Man, when I think about my first six-figure month, it was like really surreal. And I don't even think I really celebrated it for a while because I was kind of letting it sink in. And I recently posted about my million-dollar day. And actually for almost a year, it's been about nine months, um, I've been celebrating it as my first million dollar month. And I had to get really honest with myself. Um, I had to get really honest with myself to celebrate it in a real, real way, because the truth is I created that million dollars in a single day. Um, It was almost a million dollars. It wasn't just a million dollar month. I did it very quickly. Um, And so... What I realize is I'm trying to normalize that level for myself and running away from it. You know, one of the things that was like, okay, is, are people going to believe me? Am I going to have to explain a lot? I had all these subconscious conversations running. And so I decided to come out of the success closet last week and just be honest about the fact that I literally did have almost a million dollar day, um, which again was super surreal. And so, hey, Jen, I decided that I wanted to do this training or this little talk today about the easiest way for you to create your first 100K month or 100K day, if that's where you are. Um, One of the things I'm known for is rapidly helping my clients calibrate to six figures, whether it's six figures in a year, six figures in a month, six figures in a day, six figures in an hour. (laughs) Um, One of the things we do is something I call the 100K slay, and that is you learning how to master the creation of six figures And then collapsing time, right? Mastering the art of collapsing time and doing it faster and faster and faster, not with working yourself into exhaustion or any of those things. It's more of an energetic thing. And so I'm really known for doing that. And today I want to talk about how we're doing this and how you can do it too. So before I jump into it, I do have a question for you. I have a question for you and I have an invitation. So here's the question. Would you love to have... 100K months. Would you love to have six figure months? I always use 100K because it's easier to say, but my, no one's hitting exactly. Well, actually, Janelle did just hit exactly a six figure day, but no one typically just hit six figures. You usually cross it. But would you love to have that in your business? If so, give me a heck yeah or a yes. Simply type yes in the chat because if you don't, you don't want to be here for this conversation. <laughs> This is for people who really have this desire and it's not a pie in the sky kind of thing. I used to think that a hundred, that six figures and a hundred K was so freaking elusive. Like it took me forever to realize, you know, I did it in one business and we had gotten to multiple six figures in that business and I lost everything. And then when I started selling myself, when I started um, selling consulting, mentorship and coaching around sales, which is what I do now. Um, it was like really difficult. I felt like a hundred K or six figures was way far off. Um, and I just couldn't figure out how to do it. And so I want to share some tips with you today, but what I want to know is, is it a desire of yours? It, you don't have to know how you're going to do it. I just want to know, do you desire to ha- to experience a six figure month or a six figure day? And if that is you, I want you to type yes. And I want you to own the desire. I want you to acknowledge the desire because that is the first place. I literally was not acknowledging my desire to have a multi-million dollar business to experience a six-figure month or day or sale. Um, I remember having a sales conversation with one of my my mentors at the time, and she asked me, what is it that you want to create in your business? And I was like, well, if I can just do a half a million dollars a year, and she literally said, then what are you doing on the phone with me? Because I only work with people who want to build multi-million dollar businesses. And I had to take a deep breath and take a step back and realize that I have been trying to succeed for so long that I had settled. I had decided that I was just going to do small little increments, small little incremental goals. And I convinced myself that I no longer wanted to run a multi-million dollar empire, that I no longer wanted to shift my family's wealth code, that I no longer wanted to be the first in my family to be the first to, um, to, to create this new level of wealth. Because I had been beaten down year after year after year after setting these goals and not hitting them and setting these goals and not hitting them. And so the first place you want to be is owning 
the desire to have it. The moment I got truthful with myself, my business took the hell off. That is the truth. When I got honest about what I was trying to create, see, my goals from from before were too small. And so my body and my spirit and my DNA were not in it to win it. (laughs) They were like, oh, this is small potatoes. But when I got real clear about the dream and the vision and the purpose of my life and the call of my life and what level to what degree I really wanted to play in the world, how big I really wanted to play, it's been just opening up. It's like, boom, something opened up. So I want to give you that opportunity right now to own that desire and to have it witnessed to own the desire and to have it witness. So go ahead and just type yes. Oh yeah, that's me. Heck yeah, hell yeah, whatever you want to type. Let's talk about this. I want to give you an invitation because I said I was going to ask you a question and give you an invitation. So here's the deal. You can easily create it when you put what's needed in place. So before I go on, what I want to say is this. If now is your time, and you know that you've got a million dollar or a multi-million dollar or heck, even a billion dollar business inside of you, but you haven't been able to figure out how to get there. What I need you to know is this. There's no time like the present to create it. And with the right business structure in place, it can be really easy for you to do this. It's very simple. Today, I'm going to share a few stories with you about clients who are just like you, who are living completely different lives. Even I am living in completely different lives because of the methods that we teach and the community that we've created within my company. And so I want to give you an invitation to to book a call with me to find out how I can support you in getting there. And so I'm just going to put this up so that you can see it. And I'm going to pull this one down for a moment. If you go to commandmoresales.com, as I'm talking today, you don't have to do it right now. As I'm talking today, you can head over there and book a call with me. I think the earliest time you can get on my calendar is next Tuesday. Um, But I want to make this invitation to any of you who feel called to millions, but you haven't been able to figure out how to get there. Okay. What we'll do on the call is figure out what you really want. Like how much money do you really want to create? right? What do you truly want to earn each month and what your business really needs to put in place to get you there with ease? Um, One of the questions people ask me all the time, Shamika, is like, what does your calendar look like? You got to be really busy if you're having million, million dollar months. And I'm like, if you were to look at my calendar this week, you would be like, wow. Right. I just spent time this weekend um, pulled away. Um, I travel a lot. We're going to Hawaii next month. I have time and space to do that because of the way my business is structured. And again, like I said earlier, a lot of the work that I do, it's an energetics thing. Yeah, there's strategy involved, but there's something that we do that allows us to calibrate faster and faster to that next level, that next desired level. And so I wanted to give you an, an invitation to do that. And I want to be really clear about something. It's not for everyone. Working with me at this level, which I don't usually do invitations for this level of working with me, but it's by invitation and application only. So I'm inviting you to apply right now. And I'll just like pull the bandaid off right now. At this level, working with me is a minimum $30,000 investment, right? It's funny to me how people want to do six figure months or multi million dollar businesses and they want to invest a thousand dollars or they want to invest five thousand dollars. It is a minimum thirty thousand dollar investment. All of my clients who are creating six figure months and multiple six figure months have invested at this level. And um, I just want to tell you that up front before you even jump to the link to go get on the call. Um, my investment last year, which I just renewed again, last year I invested in my first, dang it, this stuff is getting my nerves. Last year, I invested in my first um, six-figure mentorship program with a mentor for myself. That was the year I did I did a million dollars in a month. That was also the year I crossed a million dollars in my business. Now, am I saying you have to go out and invest in high dollar programs to create high dollar results? No, but remember, this is an energetics thing. Some of you guys don't know what goes into a high level package and therefore you don't sell your, your programs at higher price points because you've never invested at that level before. Right. When I invest at six figures and I go, oh, this is what I get for six figures. It's easy for me to create a program at six figures and go the values there. I know that I can create that result. If I've never done it, I'm apprehensive. Right. And so I just want to pull the bandaid off and let you know that it's a minimum thirty thousand dollar investment. And that's where you go to apply. Okay, so 
Let me tell a quick story as I jump into the tips I'm going to give you today for creating your first 100K month or 100K day. So I have a client who, when they came to me, they were doing their first six-figure year, right? They had done six figures. I can't remember the exact dollar amount, but in a 12-month period, they had done six figures. This client has stepped into this community and really taken ownership and embodied their next level over and over and over again. And so within the first 90 days of our work together, of that energetic commitment and us revamping some things, and I'm going to talk about some of the things we revamped when I give you these examples or these tips for the things that you want to do. We revamped a little bit of their business model. We revamped, we revamped, revamped their pricing structure. And within 90 days, she had hit six figures. She had had a six-figure quarter. Within the next 30 days, I was actually within a couple of weeks, she had a six-figure month, right? Um, so by that time, we're about four months into working together. We are now about seven months into working together, right? Seven, moving into eight months of working together. And she just celebrated her first six-figure day. She is not the only one. This is normal inside of my community. And so today I want to talk to you about some of the practical things and the energetic things that must happen in order for you to learn how to master collapsing time and really calibrating who you are and what you are allowing in your life, the amount of wealth and how fast you're allowing it to that next level that you desire. You don't have to stair step. You can what they call quantum leap. It can be a quantum jump. But there is this, there's a, there's a, um, a whole body <laughs> process involved in this. And I want to share that with you today. Okay. Um, the first thing that you want to do is you want to, and you must dramatically raise your rates, write that down dramatically raise your rates. I'm not talking about, oh, I'm selling it for 5,000. So now I'm going to raise my prices to 6,000. So I just shared with you Janelle's story. I think Janelle was selling one of her programs for um, 2,500. We raised that one. We doubled it. We raised it to 5,000. The other program she was selling for, I think, I don't know. I don't remember what she was selling it for. It, we either doubled, we tripled it basically is what she's selling it for now. It is much easier to do a six-figure month with three, four, five, six clients, maybe even 10 clients, then it is to need to get a hundred clients at a thousand dollars, which is what most people are trying to do, which is why you're tired and working yourself into exhaustion. I want to give you some other examples of clients where we tweaked their, their business model and their pricing structure behind their business model to allow them to be able to actually live life. I had a conversation with a young lady a couple of weeks ago. And I was on her big time because she's struggling in her business, but she has a lot of followers. She has a lot of people that jo join her programs, but her pricing is way too low. And I said, listen, you are powerful at what you do, but you are a prophet in your own, in your own land with no home. You are helping other people create these incredible results, yet you're struggling to pay your own bills. And it's strict, strictly because you are underpriced. You don't even have the capacity to serve more people than you're currently serving. You couldn't possibly be, bring them in. So you have to raise your price points. So this is not your reality anymore. So on the flip side of that, I have another client who last year was like, hey, I want to bring in, I need to bring in another six figures by the end of the year, cash. How do I do it? I said, you're going to have to raise your prices. So she took, she took her 90-day program, which was $15,000 at the time, and she shifted it to a $30,000 offer. She was like, how am I going to find these people? You don't have to know how. You just have to be energetically aligned with the decision that the investment for, your, for the work that you do. Again, she helps people make money, and she helps them make a lot of money. But they were investing very, very little. And then again, she was like, I need more cash for the lifestyle that I want to live. And so we raised her price point. And for the next three months, she was having six figure months every month. She sold three to four seats in that program every single month when she was struggling a little bit to sell the 15K and wondering what was going on with that. 
right? There is an energetic alignment with higher pricing that is a commitment level that you don't get with the lower pricing. And that's for you and the clients. When you charge more, it beckons you to rise to your highest level of delivery, your highest calling and purpose. You serve at a different level than you do when you don't charge as much. That That's a scapegoat. That lets you off the hook. Likewise, with your clients, again, it's an energetic commitment. When your clients invest more, they are usually typically more highly committed. Um, the different types of clients that show up who invest in my $30,000 or $60,000 offer are much different than clients who would be paying me $500, right? It's a, it's a different level of commitment. And so you want to do yourself a favor, right? And raise your rates. I'm going to give you one more client because I want you to see how this works. So I have another client, I won't say her name, but I have another client who was already doing multiple six figures. She was doing probably about $300,000 a year when she came to me. She has well-oiled machine type programs. Um, she had a program where she was selling the program. Let me see if I can get these numbers right. I think it was like 197 and then you could do like a 497 upgrade. And I was like, that's not really a big difference. So why don't we do this? Why don't we up the other program to 497 and why don't we do a $3,500 VIP level that gets the bonus, the calls with you, all of those things. Because what that does is it gets us paid leads for clients who are highly committed that could roll into your highest level $30,000 a year offer because that's the payment on the $30,000 a year program, basically, or the initial down payment. She was like, you're a genius. She's been doing this for the last couple of months. And she's always had, every time she makes this offer, a handful of people that upgrade to that level and then move into that $30,000 program. She just recently did it. And within a day, within 24 hours, she had $150,000 a day. Why? Because this strategy was in place. So dramatically raise your prices is one of the things that you want to do. So I want to give you an exercise to do, and then I'm going to give you the other two tips that I have for you today. I want you to take a pen right now because I want you to viscerally feel this and see it with your eyes. I don't want you to imagine it. I don't want you to type it in chat. I want you to write down the most money that you've ever charged for working with you. And I'm not saying a package that you've created that no one's ever bought that you hope someday to sell. I'm saying the most money that like your highest level package that you've sold to date, what are you charging for it? I want you to write that down. Go ahead and write it down. Go ahead and write it down. All right. Now, look at that price point. And what I want you to do is I want you to add a zero to it. Now, whatever thought, emotion, feeling, whatever came up for you in that moment when you looked at that price point and added a zero to it, the thing that came up for you is the thing that is stopping you from selling at that level. It's a, sometimes it's a subconscious conversation we don't even realize we're having. Who's going to pay me that much? Oh my gosh, that's a lot of money. <gasps> whatever came up. That is the very thing that's stopping you from selling at that level. Doesn't mean you can't. It's not your audience. It's not that you need to go find people with more money. It's inside of you. That's the first place that you start. What is that about? Right? That's the thing that's stopping you from selling at that level. Nothing else. Right? So first step in this process is you have got to get more comfortable. Once you, you got to get comfortable charging more, receiving more, big money, Right? Dramatically raise your rates. I asked someone this question one time. What, what was the difference between you that did six figures a year and you did, that did six figures in a month? And the answer was, I had to change my relationship to what I believed or thought was a whole lot of money. If you think six figures is a lot of money, it's going to be very difficult for you to allow yourself to receive six figures in a short amount of time. If you think whatever that number is that you added zero to is a lot of money, it's going to be very difficult for you to allow yourself to be compensated at that level. Change your relationship to what you believe is a whole lot of money. 
That's a lot of money. I used to believe $500 a month was a huge amount of money. And when I, it's hard for me. I try to go back to that mindset and remember what it felt like. And I'm like, yeah, I was bought into that. I was like, man, $300 a month at the time was a car payment. Now car payments are like $600 a month. Um, $300 a month is a car payment. Who's going to pay me to help them in their business $500 a month, even though that was like the minimum that I needed to deliver the service. Now my clients pay $5,000 a month, $3,000 a month, $3,500, $2,500 a month. And I don't even have that thought process because I changed my relationship, my conversation around whether or not people had the money and who can invest that. Um, It's not even a conversation we have now. Right. So dramatically raise your rates and then shift the conversation you're having about what's too much money, how much is a whole lot of money. You know, I used to think when I got to a six figure business again, I would arrive. And when I got there, I quickly realized I still needed more clients. And some of you may be experiencing that now. You might be doing six or even multiple six figures and not still needing to like make sure you launch and do a challenge here and there to make more money. Because it's not. Right. People come to me and they're like, I want a million dollar business. And I'm like, really, if you really want to make a difference on this planet, like I'm just scraping the surface, you know, and we're just at multiple millions of dollars in my business. I'm just surfing, uh, scraping the surface of the kind of impact that we could have aside from the impact, the ripples of impact we have with our clients. But the good I want to do in the world, just having enough money to kind of play and do some things out there. Imagine what that could look like if it was 30 million or a hundred million or a billion. And so I'm shifting. That's why I had to own that million dollar day. I'm shifting my relationship to time and what I believe is a whole lot of money because I have big things that I want to do on the planet. I have big impact that I want to make and I want to leave something for generations and generations to come for my family so that they don't have to struggle like I did to get where I'm trying to get, right? It doesn't have to be their story. Number two. Number two, you want to have what I call a power offer. Now, this is a, like a strategy type thing, but I, I, I don't really want to talk about like what goes into the offer. But what you want to make sure, what most people think is when I charge more for what I do because I want to create the six-figure month, then I'm going to have to work a lot. I used to think the same thing, that I need to stuff a bunch of stuff and time and access to me. We need to meet every week and all of these things. And what I started to realize, especially as I grow my business to the level, like when I invest six figures, I'm not trying to meet with you every week. I ain't got time for that. I'm running my own business. I'm out here running my own empire, making my own impact in the world. Time is the greatest asset I have. It's the one that has the highest value you for me right now. Money I can use to buy my time back and that's what I'm doing. So at those higher levels, typically you don't have more things in it, you have less things in it. And so you have to have that understanding so that it's it's not just leverage, it's not about leveraging so much as it is packaging it for ease, right? So that it's results driven. So many of you guys are have your packages information driven or you have your packages, they're either information driven or they're time driven, where you feel like if you charge more, you have to give more of yourself when you don't really have that much to give, or you're just giving so much information, you're trying to make them the expert at what you do. And what happens is you don't create results. You want that power offer to be results driven. Forget the information you're trying to give them. Forget the time that goes into it. Listen, if you can show me how to walk on water in one session, and it's six figures, and I really want to walk on water, I'll just take the one session. You don't have to stretch it out for 12 months. <laughs> just give me the job done and tell me what the what the investment is for the transformation. I hope you caught that, right? So your power offer is results-driven. That's one reason why it's results-driven, because your clients really don't care what all goes in it and what your methodologies and your modalities are and how all of that, they don't care. They just want the result. The second part of it is this. Results sell. So what happens is when you have a preponderance of evidence where you've shown one person how to do six figure months and the next person how to do six figure months and over and over and over again. So if I focus on the results, focus on making sure that my package has just enough in it for my clients to create the results, what then happens is those results begin to sell on their own and it becomes a never ending stream of leads and clients for you. Some of you guys are so busy packing people into courses 
and running to go get the next clients, these people over here aren't getting any results and you can't figure out why you can't find more leads and more clients. That power office offer, you want it to be focused on results. You want it to be focused on results. The other thing is you want to stop solving broke people's problems with your, with your offers. You're wondering why you're getting so many people that come in that tell you they can't afford it and you have to do so many sales calls. I talk to people, sometimes they're like, yeah, I book 10 sales calls a week and they're still not doing six figures in a year. And I'm like, something is broken in the system because your languaging, your messaging, your offers are all geared towards broke people. They're geared to solve the problem in a way that somebody who doesn't have the money to invest or who is unwilling to invest is attracted to that messaging. And so what you want to do is you want to shift that. You want to give people the result right away. What is the highest probability of the deepest transformation for those people? When they invest, how can their life be, have the, how can you have the biggest impact on their life, their business, their body, their relationship, whatever it is that you do right away? That changes the game. It is a game changer. Now we're no longer stringing people along with these little bitty increments of, let me do a masterclass for $49. And then I'll tell you the big stuff that's really going to change your life. I'm like, no, boo, let's jump right in. I have a 30K offer. We can spend 12 months together and I can totally change your entire life. Listen, I have clients who last year this time were trying to figure out how they were going to put pampers or diapers on their kids who now have nannies right? Like our lives are completely different. We're living on a totally different plane than we were living in the beginning of 2020 even, right? Because of this concept that I'm, I'm sharing with you right now, we're solving problems for the highest level people, right? People want the results. And then when you can get those people, those results, those results will sell other people into your program. So what's the highest probability of the deepest transformation? And start there. Most of my clients, we start with their highest level offer, filling that, and then we work our way back down to the lower end offers. And most people teach you to do the opposite. Last one that I'm going to give you for today is the power of focus. The power of focus Remember I said I had to own my desire, right? So here's the other piece of it. And focus stands for follow one course until successful. We are laser focused in my community. If you want six-figure clients or you want to have a six-figure month, that's all you focused on until it's done. You hit it until you hit it. That's what we focus on. So if we know that we have a $10,000 offer and we need 10 people in a program, we're not like, oh, well, maybe I should sell this offer and maybe I should sell this offer. It's like, no, I'm doing whatever I need to do to generate leads. Do whatever I need to do to generate leads. My messaging needs to be on point, right? You focus on the right thing. Some of you guys are all over the place with like, I need to do... Um, a branding photo shoot and I need to sell a little masterclass here and a little masterclass here. It looks like my internet connection is, is kind of slow. So I'm hoping you guys are catching all of this. A little masterclass here and a little masterclass here. And I'm now going to do this offer into that. And then hopefully I'm going to get people into my year long mastermind. That's $20,000, right? And by the time you get there, the result doesn't turn out the way that it should turn out. If the result is that you want to make X amount of dollars or that you, let's say you want to make 100K in 30 days. You need to look at it and go, okay, what creates 100K in 30 days for me, right? What, what gets me 100K month? Then you have to develop this no matter what attitude about it in a way, not in a driving way. Cause I see a lot of people like, oh, about to do this 100K month, about to do this million dollar year. You never do it. Cause that energy is rooted in lack. It's rooted in, I don't have it. The no matter what attitude is, <laughs> it's a done deal. There's nothing I can do to block it. It's a done deal. There's a, there's a energy to it. Done and done. I ain't even worried about it. It's happening. And so I'm going to do my part and let God do the rest. And then you do your part. Then you do your part. Here's the thing. You got to focus on the right things to make it happen, right? It's not um, a, a brand photo shoot. I just had a client come to me and she was like, you know, what do I need to focus on for this brand photo shoot? I'm like, really, it's not about the brand photo shoot. It's about your messaging and embodying that messaging to the highest degree, because who you be 
and the messaging of your offer has an energetic signature to it. So it doesn't matter what you say, the energy behind the words, that frequency that's tied to it, whether it's lack and I don't have clients, you can be like, I'm the best in the world. You can say you're at six figures when you're not. People will know. They can sense the energy behind it. And that frequency only claws in like frequencies, right? So you, what you want to do is you want to focus. You want to focus on embodying that message. You want to focus on having the highest level sales skills, which is generating leads. Like you got to know how to create leads. I have clients who do one post and generate a hundred leads from one post because they've embodied their message. When they put the post out there, they, they know the strategy behind what to do so they can see the leads. Some of you guys don't even know how to see a lead. Once you get 100 leads in or 50 leads in or 25 leads in, then now the thing is focus on those leads and turning them into converted clients, turning them into conversations. That is all we focus on. How do I generate the lead? And from the leads, and a lead is not a person who books on your calendar. A lead is a person who raises their hands and said they want more information. That's it. So when you learn how to master the skill set of doing that and embodying your messaging in a way that gets people to raise their hand, you can generate 100 leads from a single post, right? This is part of the strategies I teach inside of my communities. Then you take those leads and you turn them into clients. And most people are all over the place because here's the deal. When you know how to generate leads, like if you had 100 leads in a month, what could you do, right? Again, now you take those 100 leads, you do the couple of things to generate the leads, and then you turn those into conversations so they become clients. And that's simply it. We just focus. If you're selling a $30,000 offer, it takes three to four clients to hit six figures. If you're selling a $25,000 offer, it takes four clients. Some of you don't even need to do that many sales calls. You have 80, 90% closing ratios. You have, even if you had a 60% close, closing ratio and you wanted four clients, you literally wouldn't need 100 leads to do that. But you're not focused. You're focused on looking good on the internet. You're focused on making it look like you're professional or making it look like you're further ahead in your business than you, than you actually are. You're focusing on the banner that goes under your live stream video, or you're focused on, you know, making your stories look cool and, you know, having that intro, um, the intro frame with the countdown timer and the music. So you look like you got something going on and you're spending all your time doing that instead of focusing on what actually works to get clients. I can do a couple of posts in a week and fill an entire program because I've been doing this strategy and focusing on this strategy over and over and over again. And the same thing happens with my clients. Focus. Focus on what matters. What your website looks like doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Your, what your brand looks like doesn't even really matter. Right? Um, I built a multi-million dollar business with landing pages, no website, just landing pages. And those pages were just to funnel people to the things I wanted to funnel them to. Like, hey, here's a page for my application. Just simple stuff. We are just now branding my company. I'm just now about to put up a website. We just started playing around with Facebook ads. Um, and I'm about to ditch those because I'm like, I built a multi-million dollar company without doing this. Now I feel like I'm just shh, 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 giving away money. Even though the ads bring us, we are building our, our list, right? Oh, and I did it with a list of under 2,000 people. Mostly it was under 1,000 people, right? Because of this power of focus. <laughs> I was talking to one of my coaches the other day, one of my mentors. And he's like, I really want to get behind the hood of what it is that you do. And so I'm like, yeah. So I fill most of my programs before I ever go public with them. And we have a strategy called a hit list strategy. And what I do is I go to my list of people first before I publicly fill the program. I'm usually able to fill 80% of the program, if not 90% or all the way. And he goes, oh, so you have an email list. I was like, no, you're not listening. And so I was like, I have a list and I pick up my journal. He's like, so what you're telling me is you built a multi-million dollar business from a journal. I said, yes, sir. I absolutely did <laughs> because I focus on what matters most. Okay. I focus on what matters most. So those are the three things that I wanted to give you today. Dramatically raise your rates, have a power offer, offer that's focused on results, and then focus on the things that actually matter that move clients forward. 
Um, in my programs, that's one of the things that we do that causes my clients to collapse time. I remove all the fluff of all the things they think they need to do, all the things they think they need to be learning. And it's like, where are the leads and where are the people who are ready to buy right now? And they become laser focused on being able, having the skill set of being able to see those things. Because when your brain is scattered in all over the place, people can be raising their hands saying, I want to buy, I want to buy. You can't even see it. Because you're too busy being busy. You're too busy looking good. <laughs> and you're too busy, you know, trying to look the part of a successful business owner to not even see the leads that are right in your face. And once we calm down the noise, quiet the noise around them and focus on those single skill sets that give them more time in their day because they just have to do a couple of things. And then they focus on what shows up around them. Boom. <laughs> the money starts flowing in. They're actually generating clients without all the convoluted extra things they need to do. I want to give you one last bonus thing, and we're not going to talk about this too long. But remember, I said this is an energetics thing too. You know, some of you can do six-figure months because you don't know what it looks like. I Somebody commented on one of my posts when I was celebrating my client, like, what does that even look like to do six figures in a day? Like, what does that even look like? And here's the cool thing about my community. You're surrounded by people who are doing six-figure sales, six figures in a month, six figures in a day. And so what happens is you calibrate to it much quickly. You know, there's a saying that says, I think there was a book about, I can't remember who, who wrote it. You're the sum total of the five people you spend the most time with. One of the reasons why I was able to quickly get within six months of making that um six-figure investment to a million-dollar month is I was surrounded by people inside of that container who were doing multiple millions in a month. So it just kind of became the reality and talk and speak. And so the community, being inside of a community where you're surrounded by people who are all stretching themselves towards their own income goals, holding each other, their feet to the fire in high esteem, but doing things that you barely could even fathom in your mind. Community is the fastest way to calibrate to a higher level of revenue and income. And I often make investments in my own programs and support for that reason, because I wanna be around people who are having a higher level conversation. Like some of my mentorship programs right now, one in particular, it's not just about building our business. You can't build a $30 million dynasty just doing coaching or mentorship or training. There has to be multiple streams of income. So I did a post the other day about me investing in businesses and there's going to be some real estate ventures. So we're always having these higher level conversations about what opportunities are out there so that we can stabilize this revenue that we're generating so that we can have ripples of impact with more money that we're bringing in. That only happens when you're in those communities, right? Most people in this industry are just talking about how to get the next client, Right. And that's all it's about is like this is the strategy that you use to get the next client. That is not a sustainable conversation to have when you're trying to build a business that lasts for years, for decades, for generations. There's more conversations. There's levels to this thing. And so you want to be plugged into communities that allow you to have those conversations and even not even have you might not even be ready to get into the conversation, but the awareness that that's the next level for you. That's the next thing that you should be looking at. This is how you stabilize a business, a real business, not just something that makes money for you to pay your bills for you to be able to invest in Louboutins, for you to be able to buy a Gucci bag. It's, there's more to it if you want to stabilize this thing. So the community, getting in communities is the fastest way to do that. It's the fastest way to begin to recode your identity so that you allow more money to come into your life faster. When you get this right, you will hit six figures faster and faster and faster, faster than you ever thought imagined and just keep Collapsing time and collapsing time until it just becomes your normal. What I have found with clients is that the clients that I've worked with who have done multi six figures and seven figures, the ones who have scaled the easiest to get to those 100K months are literally super focused. We're not doing all the things. We're just focused on a couple of things that get them to that result. So, I said this earlier when I gave the initial invitation, my next level authority mastermind, which I don't think I've ever made a public invitation like this to apply for it. It's all about seven figure calibration, 
right? It's about you calibrating to that next level of revenue. And for me, it's calibrating to seven figures. That's why I do 100K months because 100K is a is a an increment that you can master over and over and over again and begin to master collapsing time so that you can build that seven figure business, that eight figure business, right? That multi seven figure business. And that's what my next level authority mastermind is about. It's for experts and entrepreneurs desiring to make multiple millions of dollars, desiring to create six figure months, desiring to have pay in full clients and sales at $15,000, $30,000. Actually, I just got a message from a client this morning who was celebrating a $45,000 pay in full client. I know, pretty freaking amazing, right? We're talking about calling in the highest level clients, collapsing time, and creating big money and creating revenue goals faster than you ever imagined. And the truth is this, it isn't about landing pages. It isn't about your website. It isn't about tiny offers. It isn't about challenges. It isn't about master classes or brand photo shoots. What works now and is powerful, powerful, like tangibly powerful, and it's way beyond what used to work is what I'm sharing with you right now. There is a shift that has happened with every client that I've helped to cross six figures years and six figure months. And that shift, I have seen it. I felt it like it's, it's palpable. It's visible. The other thing is this shift is inevitable and it's necessary. You're not going to get there from who you are today. It's not going to happen. This shift has to happen. It is necessary. And this program, Next Level Authority, is all about embodying that. It's about embodying that level. It's about env embodying that next level. And honestly, for me, it was the missing piece around building my multi-million dollar business. If you've watched me over the years, you've seen my shift as well. If you've watched me over the years and you've watched my clients, you've seen their shift as well. And we've got it down to a science, right? Creating our businesses in a way that gives us unparalleled and unprecedented freedom to move about the country, to work from anywhere and do what we want to do, to invest in things, things we want to invest in, to buy the things that we want to buy, to experience our life and live our lives, live the lives that we're creating to travel the world, to hire nannies, to send our kids to private school, to buy dream homes. I'm traveling um, to Atlanta. I think that's where I'm going. Yeah, Atlanta, Georgia. I'm traveling to Atlanta this month to celebrate a client who is buying her dream home after being homeless as a teenager. It's always been a dream for her. Um, and so I'm going to go to her housewarming party. Um, just beautiful stuff. And most importantly, it allows us to create ripples of impact. Ripples of impact that goes beyond legacy. It is a dynasty. And what we're doing is shifting the wealth code for future generations. So I'm going to make that invitation again. I'm going to make that invitation again. Again, this isn't for everybody. So let me put this up. Let me find it. Because I want you to be able to go there. I'm going to put this up, but I'm also going to give you a little caveat here. I've got appointments for next Tuesday. I know if you book a call going to this link, it's going to be there. But if you want to skip the line, because I think I might have some pockets of space that are available this week that I can plug you into, message me. Just message me and say, I'm ready. That's all I want you to do. Message me and say, I'm ready. No games. If you want to skip the line and you don't want to take the time to go, like, wait until next week to talk and you're feeling this right now, you want to take action in alignment with that call that you're feeling right now, send me a message and just say, simply say, I'm ready. And then we'll talk. Right. We're going to do a quick conversation. I'll see where you are. I'll see, you know, if an invitation into this program is the right next step for you. We'll take a look at how much money you want to make. Right. What's the gap between you getting there? And we'll just take it from there. Um, I want to say this. This isn't for everybody. This isn't a, like, let me get a free coaching call from Shamika. That's not what this is. First and foremost, you must already have a business. You must already be making money in that business. And you must be willing to put your money where your mouth is. I already told you it's a $30,000 investment minimum for the program that I'm talking about, right? You got to be willing to put your money where your mouth is. Yes, there's payment plans available. Um, it's not for everyone. This is for you. Like you are a phenom when it comes to what you do. You're a badass, total badass. You know, you can create results no matter what, hands down. 
right? I mean, to a level that it's downright magical. But here's the thing, to the outside world, it looks like you're killing it, but deep down inside, you have this secret. And that secret is you're not accomplishing anywhere near what you're capable of. Remember, clients come to me who are already doing multiple six figures, but they know they have millions inside of them. Right. And then there's the secret thoughts that you may be having that you wouldn't dare utter to another soul because of what would they think? Because you want more, because you want more than the average person. You might be asking yourself, why am I not flying private? Why am I not a household name? It's okay. It's safe to own your desires in my presence. You know, you have a million dollar business inside of you. Heck, a billion dollar business inside of you but you can't figure out how to get there. And you know you've been called into a new level of service that exceeds anything you've ever done before. The impact to which you know deep down is multifaceted, multidimensional, and multi-generational. And you're ready. It's time to calibrate to your next level. This is where the rubber meets the road. Listen, whatever the fear that you're feeling right now, or conversations you may have be having with yourself, you're more powerful than that doubt and you're more powerful than that fear. Do yourself a favor. Take the action and let me show you how. Let me show you how it's done, boo. Commandmoresales.com. If you're really like, I need to like take action on this decision right away, message me. I'm ready. That's all you have to say. We'll connect. All right. Thanks guys for hanging with me today. I hope this has not just inspired you, but empowered you to the degree that it's awakened something inside of you that's been lying dormant for a little while. You know, we get in a rut and start focusing on the wrong things and we forget that there's something big brewing on the inside of this that's always been there. Because the truth is you're coded for millions. It's in your DNA. And it's time to rise to the occasion. All right, loves. I'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching my show, my channel. Here's what I want you to do. If you really love what you've been listening to, I want you to subscribe to my channel and leave me a comment. No, no, really, leave a comment, like right now. I'm not going to stop talking until you leave a comment. Seriously, leave a comment.